I am on the Heimer booth and I'm here with Andreas Heimer to find out all about connectivity. Now, I don't know much about connectivity, so I'm going to lean on this guy's complete expertise to tell us all about it. So, Andreas, what are we looking at today? Tom, it's a pleasure having you here and uh, it's really a live new introduction here. We are showing the connectivity solutions from our proven presetters in the market, having a full clone tool management software, wind tool integrated up to our logistics systems from the tool base. So that's a perfect fit for all companies, SME companies, up to large shops. We introduced the wind tool as well as tool base in our own manufacturing for 220 CNC machines within four months only. And that's really amazing. And we are so convinced about the product, we are starting to globally provide this to our customer because tool management is very important for the future. And I want to show you the magic happening in one minute here. So we see here, this is a double screen, our presetter and our wind tool software. So when we want to make a new tool assembly, it's like if you operate with a Word file. So I create a new record, it shows me yes. I want to have an HSK 63. I select an HSK 63. Now I look, what kind of library do I have? I have a drill here, I select the drill. Here I have the data of the drill. I have the shape, I have the no cut to cut area. And if I say now I need a corresponding tool holder, I just say search the matching one and it selects me automatically. It's a diameter, it's a diameter 16 millimeter tool. So I'd select the shrinking holder diameter 16 and the matching happens. It automatically creates a digital twin in two minutes. Here I have the shape file. I have all the data I need. I have the 2D file. I have the stick out lengths, which is important for my process. And now we do go one step further. I pro push this button and I transfer the data to my tool presetter in the tool room. And we, I press measure and here I have this little button wind tool. I have this file which was just created. It's 247, the file 247. I press OK and I load the data inside and I measure it. So basically I can measure it and measure the data and send it back. So, and uh, now we, we are looking here at the tool base. The tool base software is actually connected to the wind tool and the Heimer presetter. So I log on with my RFID tag and I have all my data, all my storage. We implemented this solution for 220 CNC machines, inventory management. We have one of those in every production shop from us actually. And it's so intuitive and easy to use so I go in here, I have all my tools, gloves, or whatever I want to store here, and it's so easy to use. So I will, for instance, give you now a Heimer Yodel Bieber, you know those guys. <laughs> and uh, if I press on the Yodel Bieber and I said, I want to I wanna have one of those, I select my cost center. I come from Heimer Jigenhausen. Uh, of course, it's for the machines, you know, in our shop, we have it for the machines. So I select it and say, I put it in the shopping basket, okay? I want to show you it's like at Amazon, if you go shopping like at Amazon, <laughs> so it's so easy. So if I add uh, one more thing, I add a bag for you here, and I put it in the shopping basket. Now we go on our shopping list, and we start to having a Yodel Bieber and our bag, and we start the withdrawal, and then here it shows me Draw number 102, 101 is locked, 103 is locked. If I take it out, it shows me where is the right part, it's green here, where to take it out. I take out one bag for you guys, say withdrawal completed, then it uh, jumps to the next one, it says draw number 103, and it shows me the Yodel Bieber, take out one here, and here you got your Yodel Bieber. And I reached the position and I'm and I'm finished. And if I look, and I want to show you one more cool feature because we're using this like for our measuring tools, you know. Who, which shop doesn't have the problem? A guy takes out a measuring tool, but uh, he never returns it, you know. Where is the measuring tool? So here we have our 3D sensor. We talked about it earlier. Everybody needs a 3D sensor. If I take that one, put it on the cost center here, take it out for Heimigenhausen, and say immediate withdrawal, it shows me draw number 101. We take out the 3D sensor, and it's a loaner tool in this case, so I can make a loaner tool. And if I lock off, 
and I log on again, it will remind me, hey, Andy, please bring the 3D sensor back because uh, it will show then automatically, oh, this loaner tool must be returned. So it's very easy, makes it very convenient. You can make cost, to co cost controlling in your shop, connect it with the tool management, synchronize the data, including the preset data. And this is a logistic and tool room uh, solution for every so shop size, large to small. And I just like how easy it is from start to finish. And being able to take something out on a loaner tool and having record of where that loaner tool is, where normally it's gone, you don't know who's got it, you don't know where it is in the shop, and you've got to go, we know exactly where it is, and the reminder to put it back, that is, that is huge. Absolutely, and in addition, you can make real nice, you can make real nice reports, analysis, for instance, so I, I, I just feed it back now, I want to show how easy the return process is, because that's just, it must be very easy, intuitive, so I just put it back, and what, re what really is nice, I say filling completed, I just returned it. What really is nice, I can make analysis here and I say I want to know my top 10 items. So I push on here the top 10 items. Number one is a pen, number two a Jordan Bieber. And of course I can organize my costs for inserts, you know. I know which machine lasts 24 hours, lasts seven days, last months. So this comes all with it. So it's not only tool management and storage, it's also helping the supervisor of the tool room or the shop owner or the manufacturing manager to control its cost and identifying machine number one needs twice the inserts than machine number two. So I think that's a wonderful solution and we can help the customer digitize his tool room plus send the data from the presetter to the machine if he wants. And I think just one last thing to, to finish on is you can, all, you can also find problems in your machine shop because of this because you can ask, why is machine one using 10 inserts, but yet machine two is only using five inserts? What is the problem with the machine? So as well as this being a complete connectivity solution for your machine shop, it can also help you find problems as well so you can keep on top of your game and make the most money. Absolutely, and, and Tom, you're so right. And it's not only that, you get automatic order proposals. How many shops are struggling because I run out of inserts, I have it in an Excel file or access sheet, uh, and somebody forgot to take something out or put it to zero or put in the new orders. So you help keep your shop up and running with always having the right tools on the shelf, and when you take it out, you control the cost because everybody in 24-7 shift, you don't have to lock the room, you have your card, you, everybody knows, okay, I take it out, but the consumption gets tracked, you get an order proposal, you have all the solutions. And I think this is really something very new in terms of connectivity. We show hands-on connectivity for our entire industry. And there is it for you, the back. Thank you oh, very thank much. Thank you very much. And I appreciate the interview. Thank Brilliant. you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And if you've, if you've got any of the problems Andreas has spoke about, or your shop has got any of the problems we spoke about, then Hammer is here and you can contact them anytime and they will answer any question you have. Thanks. Thank you, Tom. We appreciate it.